Let me explain about an R program to find the square of a number using a lookup table. What is lookup table actually? Lookup table is a table wherein already the equivalents are stored and using the inputs you arrive at the address of the location where the particular equivalent is stored. For example, if you want to find the square of 4, then the location relevant is location plus 0, 1, 2, 3, location plus 4. So equivalent for square of a number of 4 is 16 stored in location plus 4 locations. So thereby you arrive at the location where the square of a number for a particular input is stored. So priorly uh, you are going to create the table and you reach the location using the input and uh, access the equivalent from that particular location. That is what the lookup table is. Now I have already created the lookup table for numbers between 0 to 9. I have restricted to 9 because have chosen only bytes of locations to store individual outputs. So if I take 10 onwards, it exceeds one byte space. So I have uh, stipulated the input to maximum of 9. So I have created a segment where I have uh, constructed a lookup table. How do I create a segment? Once again using an assembler directive called as area by which a block of memory is made available to me. I have made that memory to be read only and I am going to store data over there. So here area is the assembler directive which will provide me a block or chunk of memory and lookup is the user defined name I have given to the segment of memory and data is the kind of information and read only is the kind of memory which is the permanent memory because the lookup table has to be permanently available to me. Then green one is the another segment which I have, which I have created uh, to store uh, the answer that comes out of the program. So I have called uh, labeled it as square and I have reserved a byte of location using the assembler directive define constant byte and I have put zero in its place as a reserved place for putting the answer. So area output is the uh, segment name and data is going to be expected there and the kind of memory is read and write for this segment where I will uh, uh, obtain the answer. Then I go to another uh, final segment using the red uh, ink have written. Area is the assembler directive. Program 2 is the name of the program that I have given uh, to the block of memory. Code I am going to enter here because it is going to be filled with uh, instructions. And uh, read only is the type of memory. Uh, that I have chosen and here there should be a similar directive called entry which has uh, uh, missed out. This entry is an assembler directive which will mark the begin of the beginning of the text of the program. Start is the optional label uh, you may use or may not use. However, if you want to use it as a label, as I said, it has to start from the edge of the screen or the first cursor position. Now R0 is pointing to LT, that means it is pointing to the lookup table first location or in other words 0th location because array will always be indexed 0 as the first uh, element. Then R1 has got the input, so I am going to find the square of 4 which is of course 16 already written in the uh, position namely 0, 1, 2, 3, 4th position. Add R1 to R0, that means 4 is added to LT, that means LT is in the 0th location, LT plus 4 will take you to the location where uh, 16 exists. So now R0 actually points to the uh, LT plus 4th location where 16 exists. Uh, R0 is uh, done with R0 plus R1, that is LT plus 4 will be the new address value pointed by R0, so R0 points to 16. That is LT plus 4. Now, I want to store the equivalent of uh, square of 4 in the location labeled as SQ and I have reserved a byte of location filled with 0. Now, I make R7 to point at square. How do I do that? Using sudo instruction LDR, load register R7. 
is equal to square the numerical address of sq will be uh, put to r7 then ldr r4 r4 will get the content of the location pointed by r0 r0 is pointing to the 16 value that is fourth location lt plus fourth location which has got 16 16 comes to r4 why am i taking to r4 because 16 exists in one memory location I have to transfer 16 to another memory location. Between two memory locations, data transfer is not possible in our processor. There are no instructions which support uh, data transfer between memory to memory. So I take R4 as the intermediate register. So R0 is pointing to LT plus 4 location where 16 exists. 16 comes to R4. And then from R4, I take it to the location pointed by R7. So R7 here, I made it to point at the SQ. So that is where 0 is stored. So 0 will be replaced by 16. Here B here is the instruction as I have already repeatedly told you that it is the uh, infinite loop location. It keeps on branching to the same location. End is the assembler directive which ends the text of the program. Here you can see ampersand has been used here. If I had not used ampersand, then uh, 16 will be converted as 10, 25 will be converted as uh, 19, uh, 36 will be converted as 24. Why? Because these numbers will be mistaken as decimal number and assembler voluntarily converts it into hexadecimal which I do not want. I want 5 square to be 25 but not 19. So I make it a point to attach ampersand to lock it up as hexadecimal though I am using it as a decimal number. So that is what the explanation for square of a number using lookup table from 0 to 9 as the input. Thank you so much.